But first, just into our newsroom, a Seminole County man accused of killing two mothers in a DUI crash was just sentenced. The judge says Terry Dinkins was unable to take responsibility for his actions. News 6's Mark Lehman is live in Seminole County for us this afternoon. So, Mark, he'll have to serve the next 30 years in prison for this deadly crash. Justin, that's a maximum sentence of 15 years in prison for each count of DUI manslaughter. Slaughter. Uh, the sentence coming after the state asked Dinkins on three separate occasions if he would take responsibility for the crime. Dinkins only saying he had no memory of the crash, but would accept the sentence that was handed down. But take a look in court today. Family members of the victims uh, spoke to spoke on the witness stand. And also we heard from um, the man convicted in their death, 66 year old Terry Dinkins. Emotions were high as many were angry, some crying and others forgiving Dinkins. In 2015, 39 year old Brandy Cole and 32 year old Sylvia Barajas were killed when Dinkins drove the wrong way down 436 in Castleberry. Prosecutors say his blood alcohol level was three times the legal limit. This morning, Dinkins was able to address the families of the women he killed. I am truly, truly sorry for this horrible, horrible accident. You know, three times over the legal limit, that's not an accident. That's careless. There's no such thing as an accident when you're being careless. And that was the family of uh, Brandy Cole speaking to us after the sentence, saying they, they are relieved after the judge took everything into consideration and handed down that maximum sentence. That again is 30 years behind bars, and that includes a mandatory minimum of four years for each count. Justin and Bridget. Mark Lehman, Life Force. Thank you, Mark. We're also